What's up everyone, Matt here from the Tech Corner with another unboxing video and today I am going to be unboxing the OnePlus 3T. Now let's go through the box real quick. Um, unfortunately my box got dinged up during delivery and is actually quite dirty so I don't even know if I'm the first person to own this. Um, I did take the plastic wrapping off because it was just so shiny that my camera could not focus at all. Um, taking a look around the box, you just have the three covered in dirt around this one, which is upsetting. One plus three T. When I first got it, I actually thought they sent me the wrong one since I just saw the three on the box and then I saw on the side it is the three T. Same thing. So the box is pretty plain, some information, everything's in Chinese. So let's take a look at the inside. All right, so that's pretty cool. So I like the red and everything. Um, so here's the phone itself. And let's take this out. I'll put this off to the side. Okay. In the box, you get some, let's see, is there anything inside? Nope. So you pull this down and then you pull everything out. Whoop. And well, drop everything out. Don't do that when you get yours, if you get yours. So you have the SIM card uh, ejector. You have sticker. I like stickers. You have a manual, which looks like it's entirely in Chinese. I think I have the international version, which is kind of why it's all in Chinese. Okay, so the start guide is actually in English, which is nice. So you have the dash charger, and I love the red that they did with this. I think that's really cool. Okay, you have the dash charger itself, and that's all that comes in the box. So let's put some of this off to the side. So the dash charger on the inside has the, whoops, upside down, has the red to match the cable. The cable is USB-C to USB-A. And this is supposed to provide a lot of charge really quick. Um, you can still use this cable with any other block that you want or a charging bank, uh, but remember you're not gonna get those super fast speeds. And then so you have the phone itself. And taking a look around, it is completely made of metal. Looks pretty nice. I ordered a case that should come tomorrow. Um, let's get the screen protector off. <sighs> It always feels nice to take that off a new one. You have that sliding rocker that I like, or that I've heard so much about. Volume rocker, power button. You have the SIM slot, and let's get the SIM ejector tool. I could use the one that I have, but I might as well use the one that comes with the phone. Let it have its honors. Okay, push that. And then you have a dual SIM tray. And I really wish that this had one of those trays where I could actually end up using one of them for a micro SD card slot to expand the memory, but you can't. Um, but it's just dual SIM. 16 megapixel camera on the back, 16 on the front, thumbprint reader. This does not depress. It is not a button. Let's see if it has any charge. All right, so OnePlus powered by Android. My choice in operating systems. I like the iPhone. If you saw the iPhone 7 Plus review, I did enjoy it. It just didn't, you know, do what I expected. It's not Android. And this is my first hands-on with a OnePlus phone. Feels pretty good. It really reminds me of an old HTC M8, M9 kind of device, probably the M10 as well. And so here you go. It booted up really quickly. Get started. I'm not gonna do any of this now. I'll save that for my review. I'll put everything in. Uh, keep an eye out for that. But this has just been a quick unboxing of the OnePlus 3T. If you like this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. If you have any questions about the 3T that you would like me to cover in my full review, go ahead and comment down below. And as always, thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to see more videos like this in the future. And this has been Matt here at the Tech Corner, and I'll see you in the next video, everyone. Have a great day. Bye.